Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Tina and I'm a full-time reseller. And today I'm bringing you another What Sold Weekend Edition. So these are my sales from Friday evening until Monday, kind of afternoon-ish today. Uh, so let's just get into what- So first thing that sold is a vintage needle needle craft kit with frame. This sold for $11.99 plus shipping. Also, all of my sales were on eBay this weekend. All right, next I sold a pair of vintage Lily Pulitzer heels. These sold for $16.99 plus shipping. Kind of like an older style. They had like, um, like a block heel and everything. So that's them. All right, then I sold this Sesame Street this vintage 1977 uh, Sesame Street mug, The Count. This sold for $16.99 plus shipping. I actually picked this up last May at that really huge indoor sale. Um, if you guys have been watching me for that long. Then I sold this Talbot's V-neck sweater. This sold for $17.99 plus shipping. Next, I sold these Earth Couture Sorrento sandals. These sold like 10 minutes after I listed them. So I'm not sure if someone had like a search out for them or if it was someone just waiting for me to list these. I don't know. It could have been one of you guys. Uh, <laughs> never know. Next, I sold a pair of Bionic sandals. So people are definitely, definitely getting ready for spring and summer. I know I'm gonna start sandal shopping soon myself. So these sold for $19.99 plus shipping. You guys know I love picking up Vionics. All right, then I sold this Grace, uh, not really sure how to pronounce that, but this blazer jacket. This came from um, that boutique store that I like to shop, my sister's closet. I actually got this on clearance there a couple weeks ago and Sold pretty quick for $39.99 plus shipping. Kind of like, um, it's got like this textured area to it. It's kind of a neat blazer. All right, then, kind of funny because not too long after I sold the first Sesame Street mug, I sold the second one to a different buyer. This one is a Burt and Ernie mug. Came from the same sale back in May. Alrighty, next I sold this Vera Bradley Olivia purse, kind of a tiny one, but this sold for $15 plus shipping. Next I sold this Sack Blue Crochet handbag, this sold for $19.99 plus shipping. And then I sold the last of these Pottery Barn Teen drapes that I had. I had four sets of these. And the final set sold for $34.99 plus shipping. Max is throwing his bone around in the background, in case you guys hear that. <laughs> All right, so next I sold uh, a pair of mother jeans. You guys know if, you, well, if you've been watching me, I got a whole lot of mother jeans a couple weeks ago. I actually sold these on best offer for $35.00. Uh, I sold another pair like a week ago for I think like 49 All right, dogs have settled down. Let me try to pick back up here. So next item I sold is a pair of women's 511 tactical pants. Uh, I showed these, I think, in one of my recent hauls. These sold for $34.99 plus shipping. Next I sold uh, these women's Minnetonka moccasin boots these sold for $34.99 with free shipping and I think they actually went international and then I sold an Ann Taylor sweater for $18.99 plus shipping next I sold this cow parade cow it's kind of like a um like a Mexican mariachi Kind of a uh, kind of cow. <laughs> Thought that was kind of cool. So he sold for fourteen ninety nine plus shipping. Next, I sold this Croft and Barrow, which is a Kohl's brand. Uh, I sold this sweater for nineteen ninety five 
plus shipping. It was new with tags. I did have this for a while though. This was in my inventory for quite a while. All right, next I sold this uh, handbag. I took a best offer of $70 on this with free shipping. I thought this was pretty cool. I picked it up a few months ago um, at the thrift store and just thought it was like really, really kind of neat. It's gold, silver, it's just like all these metallic rings. Uh, what's the brand on it? Oh, here we go. Here's the label. So you can see that. All right, then I sold these BOC, which is like Born Concept sandals. I told you guys, sandals are selling. These sold for $14.99 plus shipping. And then I sold this Gap Salmon Color Silk Blend sweater for $14.99 plus shipping. Next, I sold this necklace, this Touchstone. I actually had three um, three pieces, and two of them sold right away. This one I've had for a little bit longer. This sold for $49.99 with free shipping. And then I sold this. This is, um, I guess, used in cross-stitch or embroidery or whatever. Patrick's Woods um, working with a, a lucet. I guess that's how you say that. Uh, this sold for $29.99 plus shipping. Came out of that big cross stitch house. Next, I sold a Lord and Taylor blazer jacket. This sold for $18.99 plus shipping. And another pair of sandals, another pair of Vionics. These sold for $29.99 plus shipping. <laughs> definitely, people are definitely getting ready for spring and summer. All right. And then we have another cross stitch kit. This sold for $29.99 plus shipping. Nope, free shipping. <laughs> Alrighty, then I sold a Just Born Easter Peep plush. Uh, I got these last summer. I had two yellow and two purple, and now they are all sold. This is the last one that I had. This sold for $14.99 plus shipping. Alrighty, and then a women's leopard print vest like a puffer vest this sold for $27.99 with free shipping and then I sold a cross stitch chart so this is not a kit this is just like the pattern this sold for $29.99 plus shipping it's like one of the um, reproduction like museum quality reproduction pieces uh, and then I sold this butter churn. I never even, this never even made it to a haul video, but I picked it up maybe like a month ago. Um, so this sold for $35 plus shipping. <laughs> Next I sold this. I picked this up over the summer sometime, this garbage can um, coffee mug with, with a lid. I just thought it was really unique and kind of neat. So you guys know I like to pick up that stuff. So it sold for $14.99 plus shipping. And then I sold this art glass kind of egg-shaped paperweight. It's marked on the bottom there. It looks like almost like two W's kind of. That stands for uh, Wheaton Village. That is the Wheaton Village mark. So this sold for $29.95 plus shipping. This was listed for probably about a year. Some things, you know, take take a while for the right buyer, especially, um, you know, like art glass items and stuff. That definitely sits longer. All right, then I sold these Crocs Gianna flats. These sold for $27.99 with free shipping. They were a recent pickup, recent listing. Uh, here's another cross stitch chart. This is the chart only, not the kit. This sold for $14.99 plus shipping. And another cross stitch. <laughs> this is a kit though. This is like the chart and the silks and the linen. The linen had a little bit of a mark on it, um, like right there. But I did note that in the listing and this sold for $95 plus shipping. This was also a recent listing. I still had a couple of kits and I still have a few more that 
we're sitting around. <laughs> um, I said, it's my, um, I was telling, I was telling my friend the other day, it's, um, like my savings account. I was waiting to list a couple of them. <laughs> I don't know why I do that, but I do. So anyway, $95 plus shipping for that. All right. Then I sold some wallpaper border, uh, four spools, rolls, whatever you want to call them. They sold for $29.99 plus shipping. I picked these up, I think back in the fall. All righty. And then I sold this guy, a littlest pet shop stuffed animal. I bought a whole lot of these several years ago. Like literally, I think three years, this guy's been listed three years for a $9.95 sale with free shipping. Isn't that crazy? That's terrible. But I never ended it because I mean, I knew it would sell eventually. So I sold, I believe I sold all of the others. I think I had five or six of them. And I think that guy is actually going international. All right, next I sold this folk art horn book cross stitch kit. This sold for $29.99 plus shipping. And then a Spode Kingsley coffee mug, $14.99 plus shipping. So a lot of mugs, a lot of cross stitch, <laughs> some clothes, and a lot of sandals. That's like the theme for this weekend. Uh, here we go. Another cross stitch. But this is actually um, just the chart and one piece of fabric. So it wasn't like everything that, that needed to be here to complete it. But this sold for $17.99 plus shipping. Then I sold this Torrid Shark Bite tank top. This sold for $19.99 plus shipping. This I've actually had for way longer than I thought I would have. I had this cross posted on Poshmark too, and it just, it took a while to sell. I think it took, um, I don't know, it took quite a while though, I'll tell you that. Maybe like a year. And then I sold this Chico's top. This sold for $18.99 plus shipping. And lastly, this men's Greg Norman polo shirt. This came out of this um, lot I bought in December of men's clothing. And I have two of these that are exactly alike. This one sold and I have one more to go, but it sold for $14.99 plus shipping. And I actually just found um, a bag of men's shorts that came out of this sale that I, or this purchase I made that I totally forgot about these shorts and I just found them. So I have to get those listed for spring. So anyway, that's it. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and hit that little bell button so you get notifications every time I upload. Until next time. Bye.